Hey YouTube, this is Will from Me Programmer. I'm I'm going to show you the UFO shooter which he's requested. Um, first, you need to add two forms or another form to form one, which is that. So your splash screen. You need to add t three labels. One which is the header, which is 36 points and bold, saying UFO shooter. Then um, about well, 10 point bold in for your name and then copyright thing down there which is text line bottom right then three picture boxes which is um, the spaceship the missile and the UFO which are all available for download at on the website which is me.programmer.tripod.com um, and to make that the start the splash screen you need to go project UFO shooter properties or whatever the thing is and then down here which is splash screen you would usually be set to default none but change it to form 2 so that means when you start it it will come up like this yeah there you go so yeah um, then close that um, Where's form one? Form one, yeah. You'll need to add four label. I mean, four picture boxes. Sorry, and two labels. Um, call the first picture box "pick ship," or for the um spaceship. Then second one "pick missile" for the missile. The third one "pick UFO" for the UFO, and the fourth one "pick explosion" for the explosion. Now for the first label, you call you have to call it label score because that's your score. Um, back color black, border style fits 3D, and then bold and 12. Okay, four color white, then text align middle center. Then for the second label, call it uh, put the text in saying. Use the arrow keys to move up and down space bar to fire a missile. And that's four colours white as well. Oh, the back colour is transparent and you don't need to name it because you don't need to use any coding for it. Um, then you need to add one image list called IML Explosion, uh, image size 6050. Um, three timers, one being called TMR UFO, enabled true, interval 100. Time of missile uh, enabled false interval 100. Uh, TMR explosion enabled false interval 100. Um, yeah, now for the coding, so you just click on the form. So you'll be able to download all of these files from the website, which is which is um, me.programmer.tripod.com, as I said earlier. Then yeah, so that's what you have to do. Just download those files and stick them in while just but you have to design that first. Okay. I'll I'll just go through it anyway. Um so key key down, which is for the key press, so move spaceship up, move spaceship down, fire a missile. Uh time a UFO, moves the UFO down the form. Uh, pick UFO location change. If the UFO's off the form, it will move it to back to the top. Um Timer explosion, it shows the image, next frame must be one t 0 to 10, so it will play through the frames. And when the explosion is over, it will, um, go f it will change to false. Then, um, timer missile, uh, move the missile to the right, and it will keep scrolling off. Um, and if there is a collision between the missile and the UFO, it will move the explosion to the UFO, play the explosion sound, and move the UFO to the top of the form and start the explosion animation and increase the score by one and if missile has gone off the form then stop it uh, that will span it there and then you're about to download collision which is for the collision play wave that's so it plays the um, explosion sound um, positioning that's for the positioning and I'm pretty sure that is it so, yeah.
that is UFO shooter which you have requested.